Okay, so in this video, we're going to be working with the Pythagorean theorem. As a review and reminder, we have that the Pythagorean theorem is a squared plus b squared equals to c squared, where c is the hypotenuse. And a and b are the legs, and c is the hypotenuse. Now let's see a couple of examples here. The first one, I have one. I know that my hypotenuse is x because it's opposite to the 90 degree. That means that I got 12 squared plus 5 squared equals to x squared. So I got 144 plus 25 equals to x squared. 144 plus 25 is 169. And then the square root here on both sides, that means that x equals to 13. Number 2. Again, my hypotenuse is 15, so I got x squared plus 9 squared equals 215 squared. We got x squared plus 81 equals to 225. By subtracting 81 on both sides, I got that x squared equals to 144. And then the square root on both sides, I got that x equals to 12. Let's see the next one. So again, hypotenuse is 10. So I got 8 squared plus x squared equals to 10 squared. So 64 plus x squared equals to 100 minus 64. So that x squared equals to 36. And the square root on both sides, x equals to 6. Number 4. Again, my hypotenuse is 13.8. So 10.8 squared plus x squared equals to 13.8 squared. So by going to the calculator, I get that this is 116.64. 16.64 plus x squared equals to 190.44 minus 116.64 on both sides. So x squared equals to 73.8. Then my square root on both sides, I got that x equals to 8.6. Number 5, again, x is my hypotenuse, so 12.3 squared plus 4 squared equals 2 x squared, so 12.3 12 squared equals to 151.29 plus 16 equals to x squared, this is 167.29, and then the square root here on both sides is 12.9. That's it for this video. May the force be with you.